Hello friends, I am Rob. Here I am brought two very interesting and useful project, projects for the physics lab. Here it is the magnetic pole detector and this is the magnetometer also known as cosmeter. Magnetic pole detector is usually used is usually used to find the poles of the magnet. In our physics lab, we usually use the uh, magnetic compass to know about the north pole and the south pole, and we have to face a lot of problems. And also, if there is not a magnetic compass, we can find it by placing a bar magnet with a string at the rest position. Then it come at the rest at in the north south direction. Here, I have brought this device which can be easily used to find the poles of the magnet but it is very hard to find the poles of the magnet of the oval share oval square magnet and the circular magnet or other some irregular shaped magnet so here i have made this magnetic pole detector to find the poles of such irregular magnets so now i am going to demonstrate you the working of this magnetic pole detector here, when I bring this, the buzzer is on and the LED indicates that this is the pole that is opposite to this. This is the south pole and so this is will, this will be the north pole. But when I bring the south pole near it, but when I bring south pole near it, it does not buzzer. And also in the ring magnet, when I bring north pole, it will the LED will be on and it will indicate that this is the north pole but when I bring south pole near it, LED is off and there is no buzzer sound. And also in the bar magnet, when I bring south pole near it, there is no sound but when I bring north pole near it, then it will, the LED will indicate that this is the north pole. So it is easy to find the poles by this device. It consists of LED, diode, comparator IC, voltage regulator IC, buzzer, 9 voltage battery, and NPN transistor. And the most important thing here, it is the magnetic sensor. When we bring a magnet near the magnetic sensor, it detects the pole of the magnet and it sends signal to the transistor and transistor further operates the LED and the buzzer and this is how it works here I have bring about another interesting project it is used in physics lab as an instrument because different magnets are of different shape and sizes and they are also made up of different materials so they have different strength and this magnetometer detects the strength of the magnet. It is also known as Gauss meter as it was invented by a scientist named Gauss. And the, and the unit of the magnet strength is Gauss. And now I will show that how it works. Now I will demonstrate that how it works. When any known magnet comes near the magnetic sensor, it gives the output voltage proportion to the magnetic strength which is spread on the sensitive gauss meter scale to compare the strength of any two magnets so now as you can see the components required are npn transistor magnetic sensor resistance of 1 kilo ohm and 10 kilo ohm, variable resistance of 10 kilo ohm, voltage regulator IC, diode, LED, gauss meter and 9 voltage battery. Now I will going to tell you about its working. When any magnet comes near the magnetic sensor, the magnetic field around the magnet pass through the gold filament sensor and gives variable voltage output which is feed to the base of the transistor display on the sensitive meter. The change output voltage is directly proportional to the magnet 
strength of the field. The sensitivity of the magnet is controlled by 10 kilo ohm variable resistance. Whole circuit is generated on 5 volt regulated power supply to precise the working of the device. I hope you have enjoyed watching this video and you will make this project for your science fair and exhibition. Congratulations if you make this project and win the prize. And for more details, log on to www.dkdynamics.com and I will try to come back with more interesting and fantastic projects. Till then, goodbye. Thank you.